What do you feed it? Beef, meat and bones. This is one Sorry? No, it's a female. It's, it's a, a female. Normal yeah. size. Yeah. It's not at any yeah. old. And we normally give them four kgs of beef, four kilograms of beef. Wow. But today they're not feeding, eh? Yeah. So Why here, do they feed them today? we we used to have two lambs that because they were overweight, eh? They were obese. So we would starve them on Sunday. Too much. Yeah. If 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 The giraffe is called Rose. Rose is now one year old. Yes. This is a Masai giraffe. A Masai giraffe? Yeah, Masai giraffe. Who was rescued in, uh, in Amboseli from Amboseli to headquarter then here. So it's now one year old. What was wrong with it before it was rescued? The mother was uh, abandoned. No, abandoned her in the car. Ah. So, yes. Why did they abandon there? I don't know. Maybe they go on the road there and leave the baby around. So we have the rangers now in the national park. So they will rescue and take to the Nairobi National Park. Here. Because we used to have one bigger one, but it died because of the climate change. So it now is called Ross. Oh, so the climate change can kill them? Yeah, it depends. So we normally give them milk in the morning, two liters of milk, and the evening also. So we normally sleep in the service to the other side. So how many are they? Each has only one. And they consider together with another antelope. You consider antelope first. We have the tatunga and water back here. Yeah. But the velvet monkey come and eat this one. Okay. Last time we go. Just give me this. What? You've been lazy, are you? 
So the male we call Lawrence, it's called Lawrence. The other one sleeping down called Katrina. Katrina is now five years old. The other one is called Malaika. Malaika is now 13 years old. The male is now seven years old. Yeah, the other side we have Jane. Jane is now, she's alone, the other side. But it's not coming to the zone. But uh, the other side we have Jane. Jane, she's alone because the male from the other side died. So we separate them because the lambs sometimes they are very jealous. They behave like human beings. So we only allow male to go to the other side. Remember, we have male and female, but they don't have calves. We do vasectomy to the male one because this is not, this, this is not natural habitat to the animals. And we don't allow the breeding to take place. We only allow for the free-ranging animals, like the zebras, the impala, and so on. The only free-ranging animals in the captivity. So the lions spend a lot of time sleeping in the day. Now that the temperature is now high, you see they're just under the shade hibernating. Yes, but naturally the lions spend a lot of time sleeping during the, during the, during the daytime. But uh, in the wild, you see the lioness that are uh, responsible for looking for the mammal was the one who looked for food. But the function of the male one is now to take care of the land and uh, territory. But the mother is responsible for looking for food. Yes, the reason we know she's a female cheetah called a young. Where we give them four, three kgs of beef daily, except today's Sundays and Wednesday. We were rescued in Narrow County. When you compare the leopard and the cheetah, the difference is the tear mark. You can see the tear mark of the cheetah. Mm. Yeah, so the function of the tear mark is absorbed on the light because they are good in hunting during the day. It's not like the leopard because the leopard they are nocturnal animals. We see them late in the evening or early in the morning. So this one we give them. This one is now five years old. The last one is 50. The last span is 10 in captivity because. Yeah, they consume a lot of food they get for daily basis, but in the wild they can go up to seven years. So here yeah, they live long. So the leopard cage, you see that uh, the leopard cage is more bushy compared to the leopard. Compared to the cheetah cage is more bushy compared to the leopard because they are not good in climbing. Like yes, but this one runs very fast. Leopard. When you see the leopard, you see that the, when you see the leopard, there are two or three that they are mating season. After mating season, they will separate. They normally see you separate, but this one, they normally stay in the room. They share the responsibility. But the leopard, you see, they just stay in the same life. When you see the two that they are mating season, after mating is separate. Yes, that they are nature. Yeah. So, this is the spotted hyena. In Kenya, we have three types of hyena the spotted, the brown, and the striped. So spotted the largest species of hyena, and is the common in Kenya. When you go to Masai Mara, you see you see the brown one and the stripe. But here at Impala Park, we have only one. It's a spotted hyena. It's called Kipto. Kipto consumes six kg of beef daily, except Sundays and Wednesday. So all the cat family used to have them Wednesday and Sunday. Remember, also hyena love when they're in a group, but because it's only one here, he now restless. He's, he fears people. It depends because these are often the animals. It's a rescue center to the animals. It's not a must you have. Maybe you will find two males, five males. Yeah, so it depends the way where there's only animals. This is like often the animals. Yeah. That's why in this one, they, when you take them in the wild, they won't survive because they're used to captivity. Yeah. So we need this one, they were rescued when they were young. So they adapt to this environment. Okay? Yeah, so he's the only one who animal consumes six cages of beef and the one crushing body the bone because we have strong jaws. Yes, so he clear everything. Uh, so at Impala we have the common zebra. The common zebra we allow them to give back in the captivity. You can see the young babe. So the common thing in the zebras at Impala, they normally they are unique. The patterns are unique. It's like how a human thing like this. Right. Yeah, they are each other. So we allow them to be back in the captivity. They just roam around. Now that because the temperature is now high, you can see they're just under the shade. They just rest in. We give them food in the mornings, come a weekend, the cabbage. And they give them hay and the sun. But sometimes they normally go for natural grass. Yeah, it gives us also. Yes. Yeah, just to look.
Okay. Besides the zebrans, we have another cage where we have the psych monkey. The psych monkey, there are two. We have both of them are females. We normally give them fruits. We give them fruit salad. There are two. We have the blue dip and we have the party. party. Patricia. So there are two of them. We give them fruits. So this one, they feed, we feed them daily basis. And remember, most when the temperature is now high like this, you see most of the animals, they just shake. There's another one down the other side. They're just moving. So this one we make they, in Kenya they are like uh, endangered species because people poachers love them because you can keep them like a pet. Okay. Uh, they look alike like the blue monks. Yeah, uh, when you see the clothes, you see the blue monkey, but the white throated monkey at the neck. Come, 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 come. How are you? 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 So most of the primate cages we put the tires for they normally feel that they are in their natural when they are tired down they can go and swing the other side. That's why most of the tires are in the cage. Go like and yeah. right, this way. Yeah we go. They're very used to the yeah. used to humans. Yeah. So here we have the little part of it. There are four of them in the cage. We normally call the leopard turtles because of the shell. They normally camouflage like a leopard. Remember, the leopard normally camouflage. So because of the shell, they normally camouflage. That's why we call the leopard turtles. The turtles now we give them in the weekly and the cabbages, daily basis, except Sundays and Wednesday. Sometimes we give the water to give them carrots, and also we give them popo, the ripe popo. Yes, those the food. But, uh, okay. So we have the Vanguard monkey, they just running around, the blue balls. So those are just free range. Then we have, let's see the Elan. Elan is the type of antelope. So this is called? Elan. Elan. Yeah. Elan is the largest antelope they want. So this one now five years old, and their last one is 25 years of Yes. This one is five years old. Five years old. Yes. Yeah. Chink. Jane, how are you? How are you? How are you? Hi. How are you? So they stay together with them, both water back. They were type of one on the other side, they just right in because they take the same food. So we the largest sample of the area in the other part. It's called Ochen. Ochen is. Together, and the 
get eggs. But this one is not one. So you have to grab it and it's only left in the that's the license Why? Because now they saw that uh, most of the people you know, they just got this one, but they don't get it. It's a way of recover the revenue to support the management. We are we are lucky to see the let's see the the impala. Those are down the impalas. Yeah. So in a group of impalas, you will find only one male. You can see the male with the horns. The horns. So the bachelors they just hiding in the bush. So. They normally fight for the territory. So in a group of people, just come close, you see the old, all of them are men except one male except the other one are female. So they normally fight in the territory. So that's so the dominant male. They are the dominant male, yes. Yeah. So the bachelors now they're hiding the bush. The reason why we call the Impala Sanctuary is the one who starts here. That's why we call the Impala Sanctuary. Uh -huh. Yes. Yeah. The Impalas are also antelopes. So you see the antelopes, there are many types of antelopes as well. Yes. So you can see the male with horns. The other ones are females. All the ones are females. Let me yes. try to assume the run away. Yeah. Okay, yes. So when you go close, they have to they will run. Yeah, you can see the male now. Just move a little bit. Let's come close, slowly but slowly. You see them. So come on, we'll So we we'll in the Empires are killed mostly by what animal? Sorry? They are hunted mostly by what animal? Most of the time they normally experience the python because when they keep up in captivity, they never mm. normally kill the young adults. But here, there now they are safe. Only the impala, those are killed, the, the, the python. They normally experience some So they come into the sea because these are with the water in the same cage. Mm -hmm. okay. so, so these are the water with the male ostrich. The male ostrich is called Ojuka. Is that we used to have a one person called Ojuka here who is the tallest one. Like the ostrich that's why we when it came So the ostrich is now the male one the male one is the beautiful in the family of birds. Wow. Yeah. So all they take together with the water Pumba. The same cage. So this one is called the um, that's what animal is that? Watog. Watog, watog. Yes. Not this one, this one is a monkey. This is a monkey, the Vavet monkey. Vavet monkey. Vavet monkey. They just roam around, they are not in the cage.
wakinilo wanakula mdomo kwa flat like this so hiyo atafute kitu kidogo baada ya kuchimba okay yes the go to the the ostrich the ostrich is a male ostrich so in the bird we say the males normally are the colorful ones in it so these are male ostrich that, now, is that is that true in all birds okay. oh yeah the all the peacocks birds. exactly the males Normally, in the birds we say the males normally are the colorful ones that's how they attack the female during the mating season okay yes so here we have one male ostrich it's called ojuka around very fast 70 kilometers per hour but it's a flooded bird it can't fly okay so the female normally has gray feathers <laughs> it's getting very excited. Yeah. And then here we have. That's a Beza orange. This is another type of antelope. This one normally find in semi-arid areas. This is a Beza orange. Orange. It's now seven years old. So uh, we castrate the orange because it was more aggressive. You can see them. We used to. That's why we put the electric fence near the fence because we used to knock people using the horns. We only trim the arms for sure because they were more sharp and we wanted to knock the young people, we value the young people. So these are some type of antelope. But under captivity we don't allow the breeding to take place. Like the lion we are male and female, but we do vasectomy to the male. Why don't they allow breeding? Because uh, this, this, this is not natural habitat to the animals and also the spacing. Remember they are not in their natural habitat. This is like our family to go we only allow the free ranging like the zebras and the private monkey, we allow them to do bad people and also the impalas. I wish they made them in a way where they can live in gap without this wire. So. If you, you know, this is now the standard, when you give them, that, people will just flock the other side and you will allow them. <laughs> Yes, yes, yes. Remember some of the animals they are very aggressive. aggressive. Yes, when you touch them and they have to move. That's why this one you put a little thing. Those electric yeah. things, they will just come out. Yeah. Yeah. Blue monk is called Kimutai. Kimutai is a Kalingi name, was rescued in Tarabu in the of it. So King is now 13 years old. And the reason why I call it a blue monkey, sometimes the highlight is and blue when it's on feet or when it's come more aggressive. Kim used to snipe people's specs, the specs, the 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 phone and uh, also your brains. That's why we had gathered and though it can't come out now. So this one cannot the, the when you go to Kakamega Forest you'll see the Columbus monkey together with the blue monkey, but the Columbus monkey cannot survive in the sun because the temperature is high. high. Yes. Yeah. I remember all of these are the other varieties of monkey as well. How can she yes. come here? Kim, sometimes the animals in the cage, they are more, sometimes they are afraid and are shy of different family, of different people, because they are not used to it. Yeah. Kim? Yeah. Kim, 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 Kim. Kim, 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 how are you? Kim. <laughs> I, and he has long time for balancing, okay? Mm. Gorilla Kuna in Kenya. So this is 
Buffalo know the fence is electric. Sorry? Does it know the fence is electric fence? Yes. In the big fence, these are dangerous. We don't have the side of the buffalo. So we give them hay and the sun. So it consume a lot. Then, so this is African buffalo. Why is it doing that? Thank you.